Yes, Jesus Christ is alive. He rose from the dead in that day, that Easter Sunday morning, that first Easter, when Mary and Mary Magdalene and Salome went to the grave expecting to anoint a dead body. They saw the angel sitting there. And they said, where is Jesus? The angel said, he is not here, he is risen. I submit to you tonight that that's the greatest news the world has ever heard. He is not here. He has conquered the grave. He's alive. And ladies and gentlemen, I believe that there's more proof that Jesus Christ rose from the dead than almost any other fact in Roman history. I don't believe there's a fact in ancient history today so well proven as the resurrection of Jesus Christ. But even if there was no proof, no historical proof, no scientific proof, and there is, I would still believe it because I believe this book is God's inspired word and the whole early church went up and down the country preaching the resurrection of Jesus Christ. That was the thing that shook the Roman Empire, that a man had risen from the dead, that he was alive, that death could not hold him. Christ is alive. He's a living Savior. And yet many of his followers and Christians live and act as though he's dead. He's not dead. He's alive. And the Bible says that at a given moment, a given signal, he's coming back to this earth to set up his kingdom. And what a kingdom it's going to be. It'll be a world in which there will be no tears and no sorrow and no death. There'll be no suffering. There'll be no war. There'll be no police forces. There'll be no armies. It's going to be a glorious world ruled by one person, the Lord Jesus Christ. 